Bike. Welcome to Ocean City Bike Fest. This couple taking any action as well. And a boss hoss. Wouldn't be a video without a boss hoss. Ocean City, Maryland Bike Week. Food, women, motorcycle. Looks good. Good stuff. Good stuff. Welcome to Ocean City Bike Fest 2023. What an amazing backdrop. What a view. Look at this right off the bat. A Kawasaki KZ old school. Next to the Boulevard. And a scooter. Pretty cool, guys. Seeing more scooters. Hey, we found a KZ. Let's hear a little bit of that. Let's hear a little throttle. Yeah, man, yeah. Just not too much throttle because these Ocean City policemen are, are on it. It is OC Bike Fest Friday, and it is on. Oh, so know. for a lot of motorcycle enthusiasts in the Northeast, they wait for this Ocean City Festival, and this is a big one, guys. What's up, Cycle Drag? We got a great one for you today. This is a huge motorcycle rally. This is the Atlantic Ocean. No, we're not in Daytona. That's 860 miles south. This is Ocean City Bike Week, and we've got a lot to see, guys. This is a major rally. I'm gonna tell you what, they're already lining up for Shine Down later tonight. We'll show you a little bit of that and a lot of cool motorcycles. So let's go on a tour here in Ocean City, Maryland. That's the beautiful inlet right there. Such a great area. We got a lot to see. Let's get started. And there are riders here from all over the East Coast. Riders Just like in Daytona, you will see it all. Not sure what this is all about, but to each their own. You know, if it's a rally, we'll see a heavy dose of Harley baggers. We'll also see some custom bikes and a whole lot of other cool stuff. You know, we'll see a few big wheel baggers in the house. And I still say choppers making a comeback. Seeing a few more of them. Some real cool choppers here in the Northeast. Gotta give a shout out to handing out microfiber <laughs> towels and scripture. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank sir. You. Do I have any V-Rod fans in the house? You know I'm one of them. 08 Heritage, this couple rode in from nearby Salisbury. And just like in Daytona, bicycles count too. It is the bike fest. And you know I like my diversity, I like my sport bikes. God bless Sturgis, we were out there, but my goodness, it was hard to find a sport bike at Sturgis. Not here, we've got the crowd represented, check this out. Here in Maryland, we're in drag racing country, and you can see the influence. Look at the swing arm extensions on this Kawasaki ZX9, another sport bike right next to it. These guys out of Pennsylvania, gotta love it. We have got a lot to see in this video, guys. Settle in, let me know if you were here. And what a beautiful backdrop to enjoy this wonderful September day. Beautiful bagger here. Hey, it looks like a man after my own heart. Get some good shots, my man. Gotta love it. And Cycle Drag, here's why this is such a fitting and appropriate venue. Take a look. Like Daytona, it's a tourist destination. If you grew up in the Northeast and you're like Cycle Drag, maybe your family grew up vacationing here. It was the hot spot. It was Senior Week. Ocean City, Maryland. So much to do here. Perfect backdrop. Get your ice cream cone and keep the kids or the big kids occupied easily. It is on. Plenty of merch vendors as well. You know that. Thank you for charging my phone. I appreciate it. Great eats in here. Everybody having a good time. Good to see you. Well, guys, I'm definitely not in Sturgis anymore. And I found something pretty cool we got to check out. Not only do we have a lovely female rider, we always shout out our female riders. You're not on a bagger. You're not on a sportster. You are on a Gen 2 Suzuki Hayabusa. I am. What's your name, young lady? Sarah. Sarah, where are you from? Newcastle, Delaware. Okay, not too far away. Uh, why a Hayabusa? Why not? I like the way you think. I like the way you think. How long have you been riding? Uh, six years. Six years. Okay. Yes. So what did you start on? Six, 600. A six or 600. So when did you make the decision, I'm ready for this machine? After I got in a really bad uh, motorcycle accident. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm more comfortable. Really? Okay. What do you... Uh, Stock. I mean, besides for the dual exhaust, that's about it. Stock wheelbase. I like it. Uh, what was the hardest part for you to learn how to ride a high boost compared to a 600? The weight. It's a heavier bike, for it is. sure. It's definitely a heavier bike, but once you get used to it, you're good. I bet you love that power there out on the road. I do. Hit it once and it goes. <laughs> okay, now is this your boyfriend on the 650? No, this is my friend. This is your friend. He, does, can't, he can't keep up. I was gonna say, does, does he know you're gonna you're gonna dust him out there? Oh, he knows. He knows. He knows. <laughs> 
I mean, most guys know. All right, all right. Not catching me. Not to put you on the spot, but when she says friend, does that mean you got an application in potentially? Yeah, first, okay. First, first friend day. All right. What I'm gonna recommend to you is to get a ZX14 or a Hayabusa to hang with this young lady. Although <laughs> I love your bike. But we may need we may need a shot of nitrous to hang with you. So definitely. <laughs> well, good to see you guys. Where are you from, sir? Um, Bear, Delaware. Okay. So if you if you could help me out, how would you describe this event to somebody who's never been here? I'm trying to compare it to Daytona, Sturgis. This is kind of this is a big deal for Northeasterners. It's amazing. You meet a lot of different people from a lot of different walks of life around the world. It's nice. I like it. It is. I like it. How long have you been here? Uh, I just came down today. Okay. So that you're close enough that you can just spot up here during the day exactly yep what's your favorite area to hit up the vendors the inlet the vendors are where they put on the, like the performances okay yeah. you guys gonna go to the concert we are tonight oh shine, shine down, down. yeah that's where we're going oh yeah. that's good shine down Absolutely. puts on a great show so i look forward to seeing you on there love the boost so what, what year did you say it was 2012 it's for sale too it's for sale wait a minute Why i have two of them so this i'm keeping the other one i'm selling this one okay so if somebody wants it how do they get a hold of you in a safe manner for you out you want to yeah give. probably not <laughs> okay probably not maybe we'll post it somewhere yeah maybe what are you selling it for nine nine okay how many miles uh 23 23 do you have a an instagram or something they could look I'm up too old, for too old for instagram all right well we'll just leave it at that you guys ride safe thank you very much thank love you. both bikes you guys have a great day thank today you. thanks a lot so many cool riders down here guys so many cool bikes Are those furry cartoon character helmets catching on? Because I'm seeing a lot more of them. I love the helmet choice over here. Check it out, guys. Line of motorcycles, guys. I told you this is a big one here in the Northeast. So many bikers and scooter enthusiasts here from all. serious projects on site this isn't a gimmick no smoke and mirrors here guys one two three four lifts four lifts taken up and we're not just doing minor things like audio installs we're doing major projects over here. look at my man over here very skilled mechanic shout out to him and look at this full-blown engine rebuild 
Oh, you guys do it all. That's what we do. Did you get any sleep since Sturgis? A little bit. Okay, he's got a little bit of sleep. Oh, he's giving the Spider-Man a shout out. How cool is that? And there is Chris, guys. He's on the road. We, we asked him in Sturgis who's on the road more, me or him. Look at him, guys. He's got this thing torn apart. Amazing. Told you guys, much respect to this shop because look at this on site. There's probably a lot of people that wouldn't attempt this on site, but this is a traveling motorcycle shop. That's very, very cool. He'll take whatever you need done to your motorcycle. I imagine he can do it right here on site, out on the road. He just went upstairs to get a part. He's got a dyno here with him. He's got everything a shop could ever need. And he does it all out Besides on the road. Besides a hot tub. What's that? Besides a hot tub. Besides a hot, that's what you need. I definitely need a hot tub. Could you get one on the roof maybe, or <laughs> somebody could work on that? Something like that. Well, what are you doing here, Chris? Zippers builds a kit for us. This is 124 inch. Okay. So it'd be pistons, jugs, heads. He uses their 552 cam. Woo! We set it up with all kinds of fun stuff. Goodness. So. How many hours do you think you got into this project? Oh, well, I can tell you. Okay, you can tell him. He's keeping track. That's one way. I started this at 1.30. Started it at 1.30. How long do you think it'll so take to complete? two and a half hours taking it down to here. That's Three pretty, hours. pretty quick. Yeah, and then... You're moving. Then I start putting it back together. So, if I was... If I'm in my shop, I can usually... I, I build most motors on the lift. Okay. Off the bike. Because in the shop, we typically do the crank as well. Okay. In this case, crank... This crank's... Um, test in terms of run out to be right at the edge of using really good oil pumps and stuff. This this bike's a 22 I think so we'll be actually using Harley's pump because it's right on the verge of having too much run out to safely run an SNS or a fueling pump. So we'll use that but we are going to doctor some things up. We changed the bearing, we put the Toyo bearing in here. Amazing. One of the tests we do is make certain the rods aren't loose side to side and they move freely. There's no sticky points, so this crank's 6,000 out, but everything rotates the way it's supposed to be. So. Do you like working like this out on the road, or do you prefer being in the shop doing a project like oh, this? I like both. That's cool, man. When I build it in the shop, and I literally build it, then we'll pick it up and we'll wrestle it over, drop it in. It's a two-person affair. We put it back together, and we put it through heat cycles, and away it goes. That's crazy how many motors we do. I mean, we, we do so many motors, it's unbelievable. Well, what amazes me is just like how I'm astounded that you're working on this out here, that somebody would come to a bike fest wanting a job this elaborate, this extensive. Is this is this common to see somebody want this type of work on site? I think we did eight in Sturgis. Wow. It's probably just because how quick you are turnaround, right? Well, we own a lot of cores, so we are able to have like those boxes there. I have the pistons, the jugs, everything's already done. The headwork's already done. So I'll just take this person's cord and send them back and have a machine. So it goes back on the shelf and we sell them. This is the lunch of warriors on the road, Mountain Dew and Pizza. Many, there you go. You're, you're no, living... this, is, this is zero. Oh, see? zero. Okay, so, that's good. There we go. This is not dietary pizza, but this is diet. I'll tell you this too. I can't tell you how close you are to being a drag racer right now because this is what they do every weekend, rebuild them in the pits. That's why I stopped doing it at races and started doing it here. <laughs> yes, it pays better. Very cool, man. Ain't that right, Heidi? That's hey, right. That's right. right. Yeah. lifesaver. Oh, gosh. What's next? Biketoberfest? No. No. Arkansas. 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 Eureka Springs next week. Next week? You're the man. Who drives this thing? Good Lord. Do you ever get to rest? Ever. When's the off season? In the off season. And he rests in the off season. One week off. You're the man. Well, we'll let you get back to work here. Thanks so much. How about it, guys? Awesome stuff. Awesome. Come see him at just about any rally. Chris Waddell. You caught me at a good time. I did have a sticker. What's your name? Uh, Lou. Where are you from? Uh, Southern Maryland. I love it, man. You enjoying it? Yeah. Excellent. Thanks for being here. Thank you very much, guys. Hey, I got to give a big shout out to Chris Waddell, too. I mean, I can't imagine. If he's married and has kids, thank you guys for letting him be out on the road. Maybe they're in the truck and trailer with him. I don't know. If not, he is just an unmitigated road warrior kind of like us but we're not tearing down engines out here in the parking lot we're editing late at night and doing things like that but that's pretty that's pretty astounding pretty cool let's take a walk around too, show you some of the vendors here and then we'll go see the craziness downtown we still got shine down tonight how about this guys you can get a tattoo on site anybody gonna get a tattoo today any no we're passing on the tattoos but they're doing them right here many LED light manufacturers here. Lots of helmets, belts, 
boots, all the gear that you'd expect at a rally. Welcome to Ocean City. Maybe even more so than other rallies too. A lot of like shopping for people that might not even be interested in motorcycles. Just cool, eclectic stuff here. Handlebar accessories here. Did I mention lighting systems? They love their lights here in Ocean City, Maryland. Good place to get your caffeine too. Plenty of motorcycle parking as to be expected. And what's cool about coming to all these rallies, guys, they all have a little bit of a different flavor. You guys enjoying it? Where are you from? York, PA. York, PA in the house. We told you, a lot of PA people here, huh? Gettysburg. Gettysburg, good yep. to see you guys. You guys ride safe and enjoy. A lot of Pennsylvania people here. Hey, this year, we've been to Arizona Bike Week. We've been to Daytona Bike Week. We've been to Mid-Ohio Vintage Days, Sturgis. We've been to so many. Everyone has just a little bit of a different flavor. This is... We're on YouTube, Cycle Drag YouTube. Where are you from? New Jersey. Look at those nails. Oh my God. Can you text with those nails? Yes, I can. You're awesome. Good to see you. New Jersey in the house. Yeah, like I said, a lot of people that can't make it elsewhere, this is their big rally and it, it just has a little bit of a different feel. Watch all my rally videos. You'll know what I'm talking about. Come on, let's continue to walk around though. And the vendors are busy. It's a good opportunity to get a good deal on some of these things as well see a lot of pinstripe talent here as well beautiful beautiful job yeah. great Thank job you. i Look saw you. you out on the road yes we did we saw you on your scooter yeah good job thanks for stopping by um he's the artist we should get some of that yeah i've seen him i've seen him in daytona i believe okay. he's the man i'm not even gonna break the concentration you know, Twisted T says, keep it twisted. There we go. I've seen him online. Thank you for watching. Welcome to Ocean City. Here's another company that puts on a lot of miles with some drag racing influence. Yes, shout out to the great founder, Rick Baugh, drag racer, RC components. Some of the nicest wheels you'll ever see. Oh uh, yeah, if you want a set of wheels, guys, make sure you hit them up. Tell them Cycle Drag sent you. For your drag bike, for your Harley bagger, for your sport bike, they make some eye candy. Man, good to see you. I was just telling people, you guys make some awesome bagger wheels. Brand new set, huh? Most set, yeah, exactly, man. This one here is brand new, hot off the presses. Like, I mean, we just dropped this last week, decided to cut a couple and bring it to this rally. So this one's called the Backlash. It's brand new, so, you know, get you some. Check them out, guys. <laughs> Check this out, guys. Suspension work going on. Air ride suspension over here so one of the reasons to take advantage of this for the shrewd consumer is you can save a lot of money here they give you discounts on parts on labor it's not a bad idea welcome to ocean city i like this that's clean right outside the vendor area this is where the mass of humanity is Take a look at this parking lot, packed. And in the sea of Harleys, look at this. This couple chooses to ride a Suzuki Hayabusa. How cool is that? Look at this thing, too. Custom, beautiful bike. I mean, beautiful. Sounds good, looks good, good stuff. Good to see them. They are gone. Welcome to Ocean That's another video for another day. Was right here. I mean, this, there's probably more motorcycle drag racers in the Northeast than anywhere. And we certainly see that flavor carry over to these street strip machines. Very cool, four wheels. Welcome as well. Good to see you guys.
like what just happens down there, huh? It can't my, be any better. My man, very cool. <laughs> and sir, could you repeat that one more time? Ocean City, Maryland Bike Week. Food, women, motorcycles. No better than that. What more could you want, right? That's right. Found a Sportster S couple. Where are you guys from? Salisbury, Maryland. Good to see you guys. You guys enjoy Sportster S. We love this bike. Love it. They're making a round. Good to see you tonight. Oh, we got the old school bandit in the house. Love it. This is what I'm talking about, guys. You never know what type of motorcycle you're going to see. Love the old school here. Love it. Oh, the chopper in the house. How about it, sir? Love it. Whoa, sounds good. What, what would you say to people that say choppers are dead? Screwed up in the head. <laughs> I agree. Long live the choppers, guys. It's fucking beautiful. Very cool bike. You enjoy. See it all. We got the bagger over here as well. Everybody riding in from all over the place. Good to see y'all guys. Got a boss hoss. Wouldn't be a video without a boss hoss. Good to see it. Yamaha R6. Not easy to get your way around here. And the X-Man is here. X-Man. This is crazy or what? Yeah. My man. My man. Cycle drag. You watch them all? I watch all of them. Thank you very much. You my ride man. safe. Thank you very much. You ride safe, guys. Wow, this place packed. Small board revolution definitely on. Definitely here at Ocean City. Seeing this trend carry over to this rally. A lot of people restoring these old vintage motorcycles and putting them on the street and having some fun with them. They've even got a chiropractor on site here. How about that? I don't know if you guys have any back pain, but you could get a chiropractic adjustment right there. What do you think about Or How's maybe, that? is that yeah. helping? That does help. Okay, yeah, that, that helps yeah, as that well. Helps there you go. Yep. Whichever way you choose to deal with it. Welcome to Ocean City Bike Fest. Hello, where are you from? Highfield, Pennsylvania. Are you having a good time out here? It's amazing out I, here. I mean, how about the shopping too? I saw you looking for shirts. We're a big fan. I love it. Is, is your boyfriend buying you a bunch of stuff? I might pay for it, but we don't know yet. Uh, I love it. <laughs> Good to see you guys. Enjoy. Thank you. Told you you'd see some nice customs out here, too. Take a look at this custom paint. Very cool. Welcome to Ocean City. Where are you from? Baltimore. Woo! Love motorcycles? Love it. Oh, yeah. I told you you will see it all. Take a look at this. 1969 Honda Scrambler. Is it a 69? 69. Very cool. Where are you guys from? PA. Where at? Uh, new Freedom. Very, very cool. So yeah. why the vintage bike? What's the appeal there? No way better than vintage. It's the coolest. It, I'm with you, man. You ride safe. You having a good time on the back? Definitely. All right, be careful, guys. Enjoy 1969 Honda Scrambler. Fitting in with the big bad Harleys over here. They like vintage bikes, too. Of course, we have the more traditional Harley Davidson. As she climbs, I love the retro helmets. Comfortable? Very cool, guys. You guys enjoy. Be safe. It is Ocean City Bike Fest 2023. Where are you guys from? I love it. You guys having a good time? Oh, yeah. There you Every go. Every year. Every year, guys. They're taking it in. Ride safe. Sweet sport bike music. Got the old school Triumph. Love it. I'm telling you guys, this vintage movement is real. What's old is new again. We've done just about everything there is to do in the motorcycle industry, from big wheels to baggers. Choppers have come and gone now. I think vintage bikes are what's really gonna heat up the next few years. Welcome to Ocean City. <laughs> Some motorcycle riders say you need eyes in the back of your head and this man's taking it seriously. Uh-oh, you hate to see this. We've got a thrash going on right outside of 7-Eleven. Tolls, body work. Hopefully it's not extensive. I don't know what's going on with that Yamaha. What do you think happened? All right, so we found out what's going on from these gentlemen. Radiator leak, you're saying, unfortunately? Ah, but they're bringing some stop leak. Yep. All right, so hopefully we get it plugged up. Where are you guys from? Uh, Pasadena, Maryland. How far away is that? Two and a half hours. Two and a half. And you rode here today? Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Last night. Last, Last night. night. Okay, you got to play stay tonight? Yep. Okay, so you're good for tonight. Hopefully, we get it fixed tomorrow. Yes, sir. Best of luck, guys. They're wrenching like it's a drag race here in the parking lot. <laughs> So 
Oh, we got the sport bikers rolling with the Harleys. Where are you guys from? Pennsylvania. Where at? Lancaster County area. Oh my gosh, there are so many people here from PA. Gotta love it, guys. You guys enjoy. Some riding here. Well, here's some cool custom paint. That it must be a wide glide. Where are you guys from? Harrisburg, PA. Everybody from Pennsylvania. I love it. And I see you got the jacket and the fleece on, so it's not just me who's getting a little bit yeah, cold, yeah. huh? <laughs> guys, enjoy tonight. That Check it out, cool. guys. Very cool paint on this wide glide. It's beautiful. Hey, look, look at me. I, I thought I was a wimp from being down in Florida. I had to go to the hoodie, and the phone says it's like 70, but it feels a little bit colder than that, and I'm just really not used to it. So seeing some other people covered up, all right. I might not be that much of a wimp. There you go, that might be the coolest paint job. I love it. Where are you guys from? Okay, you guys be safe, guys. Take a look. We told you you're gonna see a lot of cool custom bikes here. Awesome guys, good to see you. We got the crew back here. We got my man over here. Good to see you. We got the whole crew. Oh, we got the whole crew up here. A lot of people will come in and rent out houses. Dude, that's a good alternative to a hotel. Uh-oh, it looks like somebody is unfortunately getting pulled over. Terrible guy. Yikes, might have got pulled over for not being a motorcycle. Side by side. You gotta be careful, you gotta obey those traffic laws because the Maryland State Troopers have been out looking for those who commit infractions. I think we might have an infraction here on the side by side. Maybe the infraction is he's not a motorcycle. Uh, maybe the state troopers have had enough of these side by sides, the slingshots. Check out my man on the eighth hanger handlebar machine. Still over here. Not exactly sure what's going on. Multiple tickets being written it looks like. Uh, what do you think he did? Let me know in the comments. And I, I couldn't tell from this vantage point. Yes, it is a slingshot. So hopefully, hopefully nothing major. What happened here? I don't know. Let's not get hit by a bus. That would not be a good ending to our day. Trying to stay out of trouble themselves. Nobody wants to leave a motorcycle rally with a ticket. That's not a pleasant experience. Maybe you'll get lucky and just get a warning. That would be nice. Check it out, the Victory representing. Nice motorcycle, guys. Very, very cool. And back here, we've got the Indian. And we gotta give a shout out to another female rider. I love it. Where are you from? Pennsylvania. At, where at? Allentown. Ride safe, gotta love it. Beautiful Indian that she's on over here as well. Shout out to her. Look at that, look at the hand shifter. How about it, man? Wow. Got your work cut out for you, huh? Not really. It's been on there about eight years now. <laughs> Is that your favorite beer? There we go. Pennsylvania rally and that is bringing a tear to this Pennsylvania boy's eye because Pennsylvania a very underrated state for how many motorcycles there are rich Freeland has a Harley dealership there he tells me we sell motorcycles all year even though the weather is not conducive for riding four or five sometimes six months out of the year there are a lot of motorcycle riders in Pennsylvania Uh, we got people firing up the barbecue grill. Uh, is there any smell better than charcoal? Mm, mixed with some motorcycle premium octane gas. Yeah, I like it. Strategic with where you stay too. A lot of the motorcycle guys like the covered parking and you, you can't get it here. Hey, here's an M109. Love these bikes, the Suzuki Boulevard. They fit in nice with the rest of the crew. Now look at all these riders, man. They're having a beef pop over here. Very cool, good to see him guys. Very cool. 
Good to see you. Thanks for supporting yes, Steve sir. Johnson. We got to keep him out there, right? That's right. Welcome, bikers, even for the Sopranos. Thank you very much for that. Never got into that show. Probably would have loved it because I love all the Scorsese flicks. I love Goodfellas. I love Casino. Have to check it out, though, for sure. And getting back to that sign and how some of these businesses are open, guys, remember, this is not Florida where they have sunshine 24-7. Kind of a, a weird situation down here. This is such a big vacation hotspot for people in the Northeast. But guess what? That lasts about three months. Then the kids go back to school. Then the $400 a night rooms go down to like $89 a night. So they have to make their money while they can. And I'm sure they welcome in this end of season event because it brings a whole lot of people. And check it out, the Ford's Edge Villa has a big advantage. They even have a garage. You know motorcycle riders are going to love that, absolutely. You never know what you'll see. Oh my goodness. From the Breezewood Proving Grounds, it's an MX track. And this is like the Boot Hill Saloon of Ocean City, this place is slammed. Yeah, welcome bikers. See what I mean? A lot of excitement and for good reason. The bikers are here having a good time. Good to see y'all guys. Good to see you. Everybody ready to go tonight. Yes, they are. Hey, check out this one. Hey, how you doing? You're not the guy that does some drag races. Yes, sir. It's good to see you, man. Watch your videos. Thank right? you for being here. We're on right now. We're just checking out this massive humanity. Check us out, guys. Major, major, major outdoor facilities. This is great or what? No! No, I'm too old for this shit. I'm done. <laughs> this, I said last year I wasn't coming back. My buddy's moving away, so this is the last one. I'm done. Thank you for being here, man. Good to see you. Sorry. See you. That's all right. I love it. Can they come see you and get a drink? Yeah. Awesome. Great job. This is when you see this bar. This place is packed. get Daytona or run for their money. Normally Main Street, it takes till about nine or 10 to get really silly. The blood alcohol here is up really high at about seven. Shout out, good to see everybody having a good time dancing. What an uh, turnout, what an amazing turnout. Welcome to Ocean City. Gets wild out here in the alleyway as well too, guys. We see some cool bikes, check out the custom paint here. Love it. Well done, very nice motorcycle. Just one of the many that you will see, and let's check out the plate. Yep, he's from Maryland. Told you you would see some unique, distinct creations back here, some unique bikes, that's for sure. Not just Harley baggers. Military style trike over here, pretty cool. The bearded clam. Here's a policy for a lot of these bars too. They just really, they don't want any conflicts, any problems, so they just say, no callers. But did I mention an uptick in business or what? Wow. And guys, I think true equality is here because there's not one female bartender back there. Four dudes at a motorcycle rally. That might be a first. Hey, ladies like it. These lovely ladies. Ladies, I got to get your take on this. This is an all-male staff. I, I'm looking normally... Normally we see some lovely ladies behind the bar, but it's all men. What's your take on this? I'm gonna start in an hour, so <laughs> it's all good. Do you like, is it good eye candy for you? Um, no. Yeah, I love Dylan, I love Killa, I love Jimmy, I love Billy. Billy. All right. all great. Well, that's good. We're just all about equal opportunity here. I'm glad you ladies are enjoying 
and shout out to our hard working guys behind the bar. So there you have it, Cycle Drag. I popped out. You guys got to let me know what you think about this very interesting strategy. Uh, whoever owns this bar, what is it called? It's called the Bearded Clam Bar. He's being loyal to his homeboys, all male bartending staff. Talk amongst yourselves in the comments. Is this a good idea? Bad idea? Should it be mixed? Or we've seen so many all-female crews. Is it is it equality to see a male crew? Is he losing a ton of money? I don't know. Let me know what you think down below. Let's see what the bartending situation is in Crawl Street. As another another all-male bartending set. Another all-male bartending set. Somebody better call Karen Noel and all of our friends from Daytona and Sturgis. They don't have any female bartenders in Maryland. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know what the making is, guys. Do they not have female bartenders in Ocean City, Maryland? We got these fine gentlemen keeping us safe. We say thank you very much to them and all the Catwoman coming up to have a conversation with them. Oh boy. So many bikers. Hey, you know, I'm all for the male bartender. I'm just saying, this is kind of messing up my montage that I have. Hey, and how about the e-bikes? E-bikes in the house, let me see you. There we go. There, so that's a question for the comments. We're seeing more and more e-bikes and bicycles at motorcycle rallies. Does it count? Well, here's all I know. We're getting close to shine down. Just like Sturgis, they have some amazing, amazing music here. Billy Idol played last night. They, they also have horses. Whoa. Check this out, guys. They got some horses up here. We've got horses. I can tell you this, guys. You definitely don't want to misbehave in Ocean City, Maryland. They have police on motorcycles, police in different vehicles, and police on horses. They've got it covered. Wow, I don't know what that gentleman did right there, but he seems a little intoxicated. And what did I say? Every motorcycle rally has a little bit of a different flavor. And I don't know that any rally has a, a, a boardwalk, maybe Myrtle. I've never even been to Myrtle, but I know Daytona's boardwalk's not quite like this. It's a special place here, guys, special place. And I'll tell you, foot traffic really picking up here on a Friday night. As I said, be on your best behavior here, but we appreciate these guys keeping everybody safe. Thank you very much. Welcome to Ocean City. All right, let's try one more, the cork bar. I bet they'll have some ladies working in here. This place is, is hopping. Guys, there's no female bartenders in Ocean City. None. What is going on? Guys, this is unbelievable. It is unbelievable. There are no women. There are no women in Ocean City, Maryland. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Ocean City. You having fun? Yes. That's what it's all about. You guys having a good time? Yeah. yeah. Ocean City, Maryland Bike Fest, OC Bike Fest. It's the dancing queen. She loves it. She's taking a street sign, guys. A st oh my gosh. Wow. Look at this. Oh my goodness. What a show she's putting on. Oh my goodness. You never know what you're gonna see at OC Bike Fest. Shout out to this hardworking young lady doing a great job. I'm putting on a big show for all of her friends over here apparently. That is a pay to park sign. That is not a pool to gentlemen's club, but she's making do with what she has, guys. All right, let's show you some of these great motorcycles here. Shout out to our female riders, by the way. Good to see you, good to see you. Everybody's good. We got Sport by Hall with the CBR. Very cool. We're still going over there. Look at the endurance, dude. My goodness. That's some endurance. What a show she's putting on. What you, there you go. Well deserved. Well deserved. A big round of applause from her crew. They love it. They love it. Very nice. Oh, wait a minute. Now this guy. Who's getting on there next? You never know what you'll see at the OC Bike Fest, guys. Wow. Definitely a wild time. Definitely a crazy time. We'll see it all here, guys. Got a couple of together. Enjoy it. Not easy to find a parking spot. Take a look inside this bar. Stay with us. Again.
Stewart. I think she wins the coolest hat in the world. Awesome hat over here. Very, very cool. Love it. Good hat. Good job. Good job. Good job with the hat. Nice job. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Let's take a look inside here. Let's see what's going on. Something going on everywhere, but now it's time for the real main event, and that is Shine Down. So let's get in and check it out. Quite a bit different than it looked earlier today. Take a look, guys. Absolutely jam packed. Getting ready for Shine Down. Billy Idol played last night. I think Leonard Skinner is going to close this thing down, but tonight it's Shine Down. Shine Down is one of my favorite bands, so I'm totally pumped for this. Now, one thing's going to be very different from Sturgis. If you watched our video from the Buffalo Chip, no motorcycles allowed in the facility. In Sturgis, they rode right up to the stage, revved them to the point where we thought they were going to blow them up in between songs, but that's not going to happen here, I don't think so. We got it done. There will be a show tonight. who you are that's what you go after and don't be afraid of failure and don't be afraid to fail i'm telling you you need to fail as a matter of fact fail as much as you possibly can because it's going to teach you what to do but i guarantee you this listen up your life and your legacy is not going to be built by your failure your life and your legacy will be built by the fact that you refuse to give up i promise you yeah. now the only thing we ask is that you leave these stars up the whole time just for this next song Follow us. And remember, sometimes it comes to the ship. This is why you're always running. Are you sure? Yeah! A second. Ladies and gentlemen, a man who I know is happy to be here because he's happy to be anywhere and he has the nicest pants on this stage tonight. He's been staring at his beautiful Viking self all night long, beating the ever loving shit out of him. Don't you worry to what the devil are You don't understand
Columbus by Shinedown. They played for about two hours, brought all the hits, a whole lot of energy. That was awesome. And there were a few beverages consumed out here, that is for sure. Look at all the people ready to ride out of here and get on to the next one. Great show, Shinedown. Awesome crowd, great energy. No problems, good crowd. Like I said, I come to a lot of these motorcycle rallies. Sometimes the motorcycle crowd gets a bad rap. I don't see any problems here. Everybody minding their own business on best behavior. Getting ready for the ride home. How about that Ferris wheel for a perfect beach background? Yeah, I know that's we got the motorcycle rides going. And I think there's a little taste of Mardi Gras. They're dropping beads down here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, the boardwalk is still jumping. Everybody wants fries. Everybody wants ice cream, all the late night treats. And I bet that alley is still jumping with all the bikes too. Check this out. How about, wow, nice. I like it. That's cool. And the furries are out. What have I said over and over again? You never know what you're gonna see here. Oh yeah, it's still jumping. There we go guys, some of the motorcycles at Oak Seat Bike Fest rolling out. Place is packed. It has been a non-stop party. This is kind of the meeting spot. This is the main street, if you will, to give you an example. If this was Daytona, if this was Sturgis, this is the main drag of Ocean City, Maryland. There are a ton of motorcycles in town. A ton of motorcycles here, 100%. Let's take a look at who we got over here at the lights. Still a long line of traffic. City, Maryland, OC Bike Fest. Make sure to check out all of our rally videos. We were in Arizona this year. We are in Daytona. We are in Sturgis. We are at Mid-Ohio, and there's a lot more coming. So the best way you can make sure you don't miss anything is to hit subscribe with notifications on. Comment below. Let me know where you are watching from. I love reading all those comments. And guys, if you want another video, here's one for you. Subscribe right in the middle, and you know if there's anything. Fast motorcycles or rallies, we're in. Cycle drag. Rolls on. Oh.